and there were so many supermarkets, there's so many street food mm. send it, like sellers and stuff that you just, I rarely cooked for myself. And if I did, I mean, I was buying Wagyu, Wagyu steaks yeah. for like a fiver in the supermarket or tuna, tuna steaks, which were like this thick, yeah. this long for like a tenner. Really? And you're just like, and it's all fresh. And it's all, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wagyu is that top stuff that they're selling there because it's their beef. Yeah. They, they I like export. About that. Well, this is it. They export like most stuff, but mm. they keep the good stuff for themselves. You get a slab of Wagyu like this and it's just almost white with marbling. Mm. And I was like, this cost me like 15 pounds. Here, you're looking like 80 quid. <laughs> it's, like, yeah. it's insane. Yeah. So I was eating good, I was eating good. The, the most expensive thing out there is probably fruit. Mm. Fruit is insane out there. You, really? you could buy a melon, a watermelon, for 500 pounds. They, they, they give fruit as retirement gifts because the, the melons are, there was, there was a honeydew melon that I saw and I was like, that looks, it looked really good. And I was mm. like, this looks really good. And one of my friends was saying that basically they're grown on farms, it's one melon per plant. They remove all the other melons from the plant. So one melon gets all the nutrients. They're under a little sunshade to stop them from getting like bleached or whatever. Yeah. And they get massaged daily by workers wearing silk gloves. And I was like, I'm sorry, what? No, come on. They were like, yep, they massage them to get all them, like to get them like, get all the juices and everything. I was like, this is insane, but it was the most amazing tasting fruit I've ever had in my yeah. life. I was like, yeah, I, I spent a, a bit of money on like grapes and things. And I was like, I need to stop buying fruit, man. <laughs> Interesting thing, you know, you know, grape flavoring? No. So like, if you have like a grape soda yeah, 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 or whatever, yeah. you're like, it tastes like fake grape. It doesn't taste like grape. No. Right? I bought some grapes in Japan, took a bite and I was like, wait, this tastes like fake grape. Yeah. Which really confused me because then I was like, hang on, fake grape is not fake grape. It's this grape, whatever the this grape is, yeah. which is a real grape, which means my entire life, this weird fake flavoring is actually real. And I've only just discovered now in my thirties because I'm in Japan eating expensive grapes. It was so strange, but I've never tasted anything anywhere else. And I was like, I don't like them because it tastes like fake grape. <laughs> I was like, great. No, this is very, it's very. No, this is the grape. And I'm like, no, no, it's not. This is weird.